Good morning, guys. Happy Welcome. Birthday, I'm 11. Welcome to today's video. I like we're tall. Welcome to today, where Sophie turns 11. 11. Sophie was born at 3:03 a.m. in the morning. So I should have woke up at 3:03 a.m. You should have. Next time. Next time. Her birthday present is currently causing trouble. Gabby's birthday present is. Actually, Gabby's birthday present is actually causing trouble. There we go. <laughs> Family, Look at how brave! For birthday, usually, usually Molly is the Brit. Molly is the leader here. Like Molly is the one that pushes everybody off the. Aw. She's like, help me, Mama! The big pot, the big dog is hurting me. Oh no! They ran. What? Really realize this? Ow! Like <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. We have a really busy I day today. A yeah, we're gonna go and get let Sophie do some shopping. We have a lot of fun things planned today. We are gonna be out and about. Very little school is gonna happen here today, but that's okay. We are celebrating. First stop, we are hitting the vets. We have to go to the vet today. I'll show you why as soon as we get there. Uh, you know it's gonna be a good day when Gabby brings her purse, and she did bring her purse. She's gone in to get her mask, and look what's happening here. This dog is crying because her owner left her. She's coming. <laughs> She's coming. There she is. Do you see her? Isn't that crazy though? Like so short of a time and she doesn't want to ever be without her. She's coming. I have one in the car. She cried for you. Oh. Poor baby. Mom, do you have a mask for me? Uh, yes. So even though COVID, like we're still in stage two where we live. There's not a lot of COVID here. So stage three, we're still in stage three. So we're allowed to go into stores and into doctors and into vets, but our vet has decided not to let people in, which I don't love because what happened to your dog? Hmm? What happened to your dog? She pees on uh, men now. Yeah, like she got really- She pees on stranger men. Yeah, like- She knows our men. She got really nervous. Like she, like if we were able to be there and hold our dog for the shots and stuff, I think it would be a lot better. But sending them in with a stranger, I don't know. People don't really care about Daisy animals as fine. much. I think Daisy will be a better. Molly's Daisy, more of a sensitive I mean, soul. Molly is emotional. Love how Molly growls at the vet, but not at that one carrying food. Molly's like, let me at him. I'm bigger now. I will tell them off. But really, it's not Molly's visit today. It is. Daisy's a second set of shots. She hates cars, <laughs> the dog never wakes up, but we're in the car and she is excited. Look how huge she looks back there. Daisy actually did like a big, huge growth spurt. She grew out of her halter or her harness. She's still small though. Like she's not a huge puppy, but she definitely, the food we're giving her has good points and bad points. I think it definitely is helping her grow really well, but I don't like it. Literally been five minutes and the dog has not taken her eyes off the do off the car moving outside there and Molly does actually loves looking out the window and she loves watching the cars go by it's her favorite thing but this dog we've never seen her this focus Sophie she looks huge and that belly though my dog's a skinny queen but it loves belly. sitting on your lap and staring straight out yeah <laughs> it's funny how she yeah like our car our dogs love the car you guys this dog hates the car though. Oh, does she hate the car? She did used to hate it because she got car sick. Molly loves cars from right, like from the beginning. She yeah, we did a lot with Molly last year. Thank goodness. Cause she is definitely a different kind of a breed. Like what is her thing? Like she's, she's sensitive. And she does get scared. Like when Jacob comes, she's always terrified. They did make friends. And Daisy just plays with them. But she's submissive. She's submissive to people. And she does bark when people come to the house, which we didn't want. This Ruby trained her. Ruby trained her good. Ruby. Oh, that darn Ruby. Mm -hmm. And this dog is nothing like that. She doesn't bark. She doesn't care. But she's young. All right, there she goes. There goes our girl. He's depressed. She's like, I didn't get to go. He's my friend first. They made me stay here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he hates him. She doesn't hate him. She doesn't hate him. She loves him. But she's on him, though. Because he sticks her with a needle. So he asked us like, do you have any concerns, blah, blah, blah. And I did tell him that we're concerned about the food. Even though it's like supposed to be such a good food, I feel like it gives her a belly ache. Every single time she eats, she has to climb up on the couch and she always is moaning and groaning. And she has so much gas, like disgusting smelling gas. Like 
for about two hours after she eats like it's just awful and every time we try and move her she's like groaning and and you can tell like she's got a belly ache and she just can't do anything like she I don't know how to explain it but she definitely the food is a hard one the food is hard I think I'd rather her be on like a hard food um we'd still have to water it down because Dalmatians have to have a lot of water I don't know. I'd like to try something else. I feel like in other ways this food has been better for her. But yeah, so that's what I feel. I feel so anyway, we told him all of our concerns and hopefully we get some answers today. Good. Uh, I don't know if she hears or not. I was whistling and uh, I know, but I she has like selective. Control. She has like a selectiveness about her, which I can't tell either. Like okay. one minute I'm like she is definitely deaf because like she was climbing to come in the door the other day and I would open the door, but she wouldn't, she didn't know I opened the door and she'd yeah. turn around and start to go away. And she had no idea I was opening and closing the door. Okay. Yeah, the other day she was on my lap and she was almost asleep and I sneezed and she almost fell off the couch from it. Like, but with a sneeze that could like, be a different tone. The force of a oh. sneeze. Is and she it. also, if we like reach for her and she doesn't see it, yeah. she responds differently. Startles. She startles, yeah. Like I don't. The, so in the, the in her genetics, they've never had a deaf puppy yet, and both okay. of her parents are tested. Okay. So. Yeah, I, and I she was know. tested. Yeah, I don't know. Um, but health wise, she looks good. Okay. Okay. So, mm -hmm. Gabby and I have such totally different personalities. I talk about things like if somebody says something to me that I disagree with I'd be, I'd be like oh okay well what I read blah 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 Gabby and it's like Sam and would be like oh okay thank you and then would just like toss it away yeah which I guess is a proper way to be I think that is probably a better way but when I'm dealing with the healthy oh. puppy and our vet that is telling me things that are completely crazy I guess you're we're responsible for her health not our vet when it comes down to it so i guess gabby is right gabby you win this one i always do see she didn't do it to me you're supposed to do, see you didn't do it to me you're supposed to be like yeah you're right and then go on with your day because you know the real me <laughs> okay well i believe in sharing the whole the real me with everyone oh you also have to roll down all these windows anyway so i guess that our puppy's weight is good. Sophie, we're doing it right. We're feeding her enough. <laughs> Next stop, we are at the tax store. We're going to buy a couple of things. I told Sophie I'd buy her the thing that she wants for her birthday. She already got a puppy, but I like to give them something special on their birthday because even if it's just little, she wants a bridal for Willow. So we're going to go in. Gabby is buying herself a pair of breeches. And she, so she, Gabby ordered a bunch of stuff and it's in. So she's going to be picking that up. And yeah, so let's go do Mom, it, you guys. Here. I hope the tax store is ready for our dogs because Molly is ready. Molly, whoops. Molly's ready to roll. So, uh oh. Is it still here? Sophie knows exactly what she wants. Beautiful. I love it. Look at. Look at these. Yes, Shetland and Minnie. Shetland and Minnie, and she's little. Look at these. This is the kind of halter that the girls want. Bridal. Bridal. Oh. Oh, it's nice. See, it's got this thing and it's really padded and soft. That's a pony size. Oh, that looks Do they cute. have those? Look, they actually have it. Mm -hmm. It's so nice, Sophie. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. She can get down now, even though we should kind of wait a couple of days. It's $150, same price as Gabby's. Do you like it? Yes. <laughs> There's a ghost over here. Why are you scared, Molly? Yeah. You've been here so many times. Yeah, she's always scared of this corner. All right, what are you looking for? You got so Gabby's gonna try on the breeches. What's this size? It's a cute bridle. You like that one? Is it the right color though? It's yeah. a funny color. It's chestnut. I know, but mine's just uh, darker. Does it? Ma I mean, it'll darken. And it has the padding. But you, cute. So you want one for Storm, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. How much is it? So this is shock. <laughs> Shockamole Sports, and this is three hundred and thirty-four dollars. Gabby has expensive taste. Did you guys notice that we never saw these these crops that were part that were over here before? Okay, Gabby, you need straps for your. You need to find straps for your new spurs. So Gabby decided to get spurs that she finds are easier to use and easier on the horse. Oh, let her smell. Okay, so, but that's black. Do you want black? It's fine. 
Why didn't you get the brown one? Because it's too light of a brown. But once you oil it, it turns darker color. Do you guys think I should buy a lead rope for myself, for my new horse? Even though I haven't got the horse yet, like I just want a nice pink lead rope. If I find a pink lead rope, I should buy it. I think I should buy it? He's just being really good. Yeah, our puppies have been rocking this. All right, first dress. All right, so Gabby tried on the breeches, and they're size 25, and look she at loves that. them. I'm Mom, look at that white collar. Size 26. Oh. Normally she wears a 26, but the 25 fitter. Wait till you guys see them. Gabby's breaking out the new color scheme. Oh, and this is for dogs. Yeah. If this would fit Daisy and Molly, I'd buy both of them. Look at that. Unicorn dog color. And wiggle bums. Thank you. Wiggle bums. Apparently, I can go on her Facebook page and order one in any size. Oh, I don't know about that. That might be too, too hard, but I love it. All right, so lead ropes. So they don't actually have the pink I want. Oh, they do have the pink I want. Of course they do. That's the color I want. Or they have this one. This one's more of like a orangey, orangey color. Do it, Laura. Buy yourself a lead rope. Do it. Love the feel of these ones. Oh, these are my favorite lead ropes of all life. Oh, and they're cheaper, and I love them. I love this one because you don't get rope burn from it. It's soft. It's woven. It's really soft. These ones are not the same. Did you get what you need? Yeah. This is what she needs. These are child size. And they fit you? Hopefully they fit. Well, you should put it on your foot and see. Put it around your ankle and see. Put it around your ankle. You gotta put it around your ankle. I'm not sure. Oh, I don't know how to do them. Gabby knows how. Oh, I think they'll fit you. Yeah, we can always poke more holes. Yeah, we can always poke more holes. Over here, I always like to take a look at the clothes. See if there's anything I love. Those are cute. Sophie's really into breeches now too. These breeches. She loves okay. carrots. They're my favorite brand too. These, th that's my size. I don't uh, like these ones though. I like a specific kind. Oops. They're only $99. Yeah, that's a really good price actually. It's always such a whirlwind when we go to the tax store because we have the dogs and then people always want to touch the dogs and then you're talking to them. Like we met a lady that had a Dalmatian and she said she didn't even know that they had dietary things until their dog did get stones and then they went through surgery and then and she said that our dog definitely is way lower energy than her dog her dalmatian she had a boy though uh so anyway we're gonna deal with that we're still looking into that but anyway um so gabby got these they're big did they fit you did you try them they should so we asked about these before yeah, because we thought that gabby would like right these now. better um but fiona said no but then Brandon let Gabby try a pair of these at the show and she loved them. She found them more gentle. Do you find them more gentle? Let's see them. Okay, so they're just like a roller ball. She finds them more gentle and she found that Chino responded really well to them and won champion at the show. <laughs> so uh, she decided to order them. Oh yes, he didn't. He came forth. Oh, darn it. <laughs> but anyways, she decided to buy them. To yeah, he didn't try and buck her off. How much were these? Forty one ninety nine. It came to sixty seven dollars. Oh, because she bought, she had to buy the bands straps. too. Let's see the straps. So she ended up, she needed straps, and they were seventeen ninety nine. And she bought these ones, which the ones that she has are from her very first pair of um, spurs, and they're like the mesh kind that you just find a spot in the mesh and put the whole, put the thing in the hole. But they're so, big. So she bought those other pair fits these. and she got some new struck breeches so uh, Gabby is working in the Navy now you guys are gonna be seeing her wear Navy all the time These, she was super excited to get them so her favorite brand is struck everybody asks me this I get messages a hundred times a day um, asking what breeches Gabby has so she loves so the ones you guys are talking about are the gray ones and those are tailored sportsmen we can never find those in stores locally otherwise we'd buy more of them they last forever they're awesome um, but her actual favorite brand are struck she likes how they fit they're super comparable to the tailored sportsmen they're the tan breeches that she wears all the time she has them these ones like these ones look funky but anyways it's just she grips. They didn't have any in her size, and so she had to either go up a size or down a size. She chose to go down a size, and she was very happy. 
in up size oh. because I had to go up two. Oh yeah, she had to go up two sizes or get a size smaller. So she got the size smaller, size 25, and they fit her perfectly. So if you think that you're about Gabby's size, 25 is where it's at. Okay, so what did the birthday girl get today? I got a bridle. She got a bridle for the mini, so you have to oil it. She'll be able to use that bridle when she's doing the Line the line driving so that's the ultimate goal and what else did you get so she also got herself a new mask and it's a horsey one let's see it um so she, this is the mask she got it's got a fin on it you guys like that is the perfect mask for her a finny mask here it goes she's gonna try it on yes i do you love it all right that's awesome Okay, so our last stop for the morning, we are at our old lesson barn. There's so many nice new horses here. Like the black and white paint, if you guys caught the video where Brandon said he bought a black and white paint mare that was pregnant, I messaged about her. She was like such a good price and I didn't want her. I knew I couldn't get her, but I just wanted to see pictures of her. I wanted to see pictures of her because I wanted to like tear, I wanted to like make life difficult for myself and I wanted to want to want her. If that makes sense but she's over there i like to go take a walk and take a look at her but gabby there's a paint pony like a little tiny paint pony the size of sparky not sparky what's the other one cricket no bigger um buns uh, or newton yeah newton about the size of newton oh my gosh it's so cute like it's black and white and they're all it? furry yeah go ahead Go pee while you're over there. Sophie and I just went to the bathroom. I already went in the taxi. Anyway, so basically what we're doing is we're sitting here waiting for go, a trailer to come. No, they're going to be here within an hour. So we didn't know yeah, what time so between 12 and 1. Or we could go to that store. Get yeah, food. we're like all hungry. I'm kind of excited for food. I'm saving myself for ice cream cake today. I don't want to eat too much junk because, I mean, we're not eating sugar, but... I don't want to eat too much today because I'm saving myself for ice cream cake. Ice cream cake is my favorite. And we're having ice cream cake, right, Sophie? I'm having as much as I want. Yeah. She's like, I have hardly been eating sugar, and I'm going to eat as much ice cream cake for my birthday as I, I want. want. That's her want thing that she wants. Go. Gabby's actually hungry, too. Oh, they showed up early so we don't have to sit around and wait. I would do anything for Brandon, though, help him out. He's in surgery today. So, not having surgery, but he's helping to do surgery, so he can't be here. But something you guys might not know about him is that he would give you the shirt off his back if you needed it. Like, such a nice guy. Like, he is the nicest guy I think I've ever met. Anyways, um, I'm not going to show you the pony, though, because it's not our pony to show. Sad, because she's so cute. All right, so we've been home for a couple of hours. Um, Sophie took the puppy outside and then put her down, and usually she comes and climbs up on the couch with us. I don't see her, and I just said to Sophie, like, where's the puppy? Aww, that's the cutest thing. Honestly, she, like, I'm worried. Like, I just do not think that we're giving her the right food. It makes her so bloated. So she looks like she's good, and then once the bloat goes away, she doesn't look good. Like, look at how good she was. She went, she's hungry. She went and found her bed. She could have came and found me, but she found her bed. Oh, like, she's too good of a puppy. Like, I think there's something wrong. Like, honestly, I don't think the food is right for her, but the food that we were giving her before that, I don't think did anything better. Like, she gets so bloated on it, that she looks like she's a great weight. And then once the bloat goes away, she looks skinny and she's got no energy. Like, honestly, I keep telling you guys, like she just sleeps all the time. She plays for about 20 minutes a day with the other dogs. And then that's it. I'm worried though. Sam walks in with Sylvie's beautiful ice cream cake and Gabby says what? What did she say to you? Her pants fit her. <laughs> a size small fits her. You know what is important to girls. Fitting into a size smaller is like the most important thing of life. No, no. Wait, we have to do. Hi. Hi. We have to do. Hi, Olivia. Now pull. We have to do birthday candles. Aww. Sophie, you get one birthday wish a year. Don't you want to have your birthday oh. wish? You have to blow out candles. Um, I believe yeah. birthday wishes come true. I don't know what to ask. Wait. One year I wished for my forever man. And then I, I met Sam. Come true you you wish for your forever man too? No. My wish hasn't come true yet. What? None of my wishes come true. Then again, I didn't have a cake, did I? 
Yes, you. we had special oh, dessert. I remember two years ago you had a burger cake and it was the best cake ever. Okay, hold on. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Sophia. Happy birthday to you. Just wait, did you like your present? Yeah. What was your favorite present of life? That thing. That thing. Even though she's so much work? Okay, I can't blow my Okay, wait, do you have a birthday wish? My birthday was Storm. Okay, Aww. let me do my wish. Okay, birthday wishes come true. Oh, uh, you have to blow it all out in one breath. But it actually, won't come true now. you gotta go. But actually, with COVID, should you actually be blowing on the candle and the cake? But we're all in the same bubble. We're you blow a family. On the, yeah, we are. Well, happy birthday, Sophie. Like, there's so much cake there. You don't have to lick off the candles. Mm -hmm. That's tradition. It's tradition. It's tradition. All right, so we are at the pet store. We told Sophie she could go for a pet shopping spree when it's her actual birthday but she wants a certain color look and you want a halter a harness look over there hi cutie molly is or daisy is not afraid to say hi to everybody hello baby hi how old about three months what a cutie hi. she's so super polite and there's yeah. molly over there she's like i want to say hi too <laughs> oh, so funny. So that's adorable Gabby likes this one. Hey. Wait, is that the one? You like the gray one? No. Let's see. You want a, a metal choker? Um, yeah, a prong collar. Get, They're not yeah, cool. That oh, that's not. I don't know. That's, that's like that that's like a harsh bit. Why do you want that? Because she pulls. It's better for training. One person has one like this. I'm not sure if they have this. Oh, I love her halter. It looks good on her. Her, her harness. Molly, I love her harness. That's adorable. I don't think that will fit her, no. Well, I think she's the biggest size. I like the light one. I like this one. That one's super cute. It has a diamond on it. see. Oh, yeah, big diamond. And it has a bow. The trouble with having two puppies is that everybody pays attention to Daisy and poor Molly gets jealous. And Gabby gets jealous. Oh, we're getting her a unicorn costume. You're getting her a what for a costume? A unicorn. A unicorn so I think she's gonna get this harness it's a Kong Kong brand and it actually is super adjustable it's really soft and it just slides over top of her head and it doesn't like go around her legs the way that the other ones do really nice we lost Sophie she's off shopping all on her own Molly Molly's doing so good the lady at the tax store said she couldn't believe the difference in her from the last time we went She's so much calmer and doesn't jump up on people as much. But if you pay attention to her still, she will still try to. You think she wants the big banana? Maybe just will play with toys. I'm letting her choose. Your law. I love that. She doesn't really love bananas. She doesn't really love those kind of toys, but she is starting to play with toys now. Oh, they have an LED necklace. Is it a, oh, it's a collar. You cut it to fit them. Look at that, it's okay, cool. Daisy likes this one about so hard. The only problem is with these, they chew them. Like anything that's Daisy material. Daisy can't destroy it. Molly will. Yeah, but Molly will. Do you like this one? Oh my gosh, she has the worst gas, I'm telling you. Molly likes the big banana. Oh my gosh, I love the goat. Look at the goat. The rabbit is so cute too. The goat is adorable. Right. 
Molly, pick a Which toy. Does this one have a squeaker in it? Okay, just put them all down on the ground and let's see what one she picks. Wait, get it, Molly, get it, get it, get it. Get it, Molly. Get it. All right, that's the one. All right. This one. All right, I like that one. Chameleon. Welcome. Look at how cute this is. It's a carrying case mm -hmm. for your dog. The only problem is she's going to outgrow that pretty soon, but isn't that adorable? I think Molly could still fit in it, though. No, she couldn't. No. Okay, so let's just recap here. Molly chose this little iguana, which is super cute. The reason oh, of Gabby. The reason that Gabby went with this is because she has a dinosaur like this at home. She plays with it all the time and it, it has like a, just a tiny bit of damage, whereas she goes through toys like crazy. So that one's for Molly. Even though it was Sophie's birthday, that present was not bought for Gabby. It was bought for the puppy, for Molly. What did you get, Sophie? Um, so I got Daisy this um, cloud thing. This cloud toy? Daisy. She likes. And her favorite is the goat. <laughs> yeah, you guys saw her playing with that. She loves the goat. I got her a harness and collar, but I'll show you after you can show them. Okay. So she ended up getting this um, har harness. It's I love it. It doesn't look like it's a big deal, but it actually is a really nice one. And she also got her this collar because it is so super cute. It's got princess crowns on it and a diamond and a beautiful bow. Don't you know that you're beautiful?